And then I think the one that really has popped here in the last 24 hours is the one in Chicago. So let me just kind of tell you about Chicago, because this is really out of the box. I did an interview this morning, and somebody asked me, do you have a battle drill for how you've done this? We've never done a pandemic uh, capability. We don't have on-the-shelf designs of how to modify hotels into, you know, COVID centers. So we went into the McCormick Convention Center, and I told you, the ability to do negative pressure in a hotel room is pretty easy. But when you go into to a gigantic, voluminous room like a convention center to try to bring the pressure down, we didn't think it was attainable. What we're doing in McCormick is we're basically, we got turned on by FEMA to do a $75 million build. So we're in there now. Hall C, Tom, is basically two of the FMS. These are the FEMA hotel, the, the FEMA hospitals. 250 people each, a total of 500 people. They're going in, they're relatively what's called low acute, not a lot of injuries, okay? And in this entire convention center is all COVID, all COVID in a convention center. So 500 all COVID? On, in Hall C, right. okay? Now, uh, what we're going to do in Hall A, we're going to go in and we're going to put 1,800 in Hall A. And that's, an, that's also COVID, but that's going to be a little higher on the complexity of their injuries. And I'm not a doctor, so I'm not going to try to articulate that. Hall C is low. Hall, B, Hall A is a little bit higher. Hall B is the hardest one. Those are 750. They need self-contained units. So what we're doing is we're going to, in Hall C and A, we're bringing the pressure down in the entire convention center. It's going to be lower pressure. Keeps all the containment in. But in Hall B, what they've asked us to do is to actually go get some type of a module that we can set inside there. So we're right in the middle of discussions right now with contractors. Do we buy something like a, what's called a 40-foot mill van, an isolated container, or do we do it with a tent? And our guys are trying to figure that out now. Now, is it one person? Is it six person? We're, we're working through that. But that the total there is somewhere on the order of magnitude, I think about 3,000 that are going to go into the Chicago Convention Center, this McCormick Convention Center, and we want to write those contracts and get that in. Our goal is to have that one done somewhere around the 24th of April. 